Welcome back. I think actually I was right on that one. It's about two minutes. Quick shift. Second to last or the penultimate, if you have an English degree, uh, segment for the second day of E Times live streaming from Embedded Systems Conference 2011. I think I've probably said 2010 several times today, but my apologies. 2011, San Jose Convention Center. I'm here with Jeff Jessel, an old friend from the EDA industry who's not in the EDA industry anymore. He's now with Element 14, which is uh, a very cool community. It's, uh, Element 14 has done, I think, a fantastic job of, of, uh, of taking a social media approach to distribution. But you're not here to talk about distributing parts, you're here to talk about design and services. Design solutions. So you're, you're right, thank you. Yeah, Element 14 as a community has done a great job of writing great content. Like uh, Jerry Ellsworth, who is yeah. here this week yeah, as, yeah. as our keynote speaker. And Ben Hecht. And Ben Hecht Show, yeah, yeah Ben yeah. Hecht and Dorn, who, uh, who is the star of the Ben Hecht Show, uh, for a really great, fun, uh, uh, technical content. Yeah. Um, and uh, we, we, we kind of liken it to Mythbusters. It's, it's our version of that. But ben does lots of wild and crazy things and, and lots of fun. Um, but uh, we're, we're extending that capability, and that's what we're here to talk about uh, t today, is um, you know, in, in addition to community, we can add a lot of good informational content, and we've done that on, on the Element 14 community. We have a lot of content about vertical markets, like alternative energy, for example, uh, lighting, uh, wireless. There are a lot of vertical market applications that we can talk about uh, in addition to some of the fun content. Um, but uh, to add to that, to provide more design solutions for engineers, we're actually going and adding things like design tools. So my background in the EDA industry yeah. is applicable here, and that's actually why I'm here, to help provide those solutions for Element 14. So we can be one place where engineers can come and find all the types of things that they need for their design. Uh, so an example of that would be uh, our CADSoft Eagle PCB design tools. Mm. Uh, very easy to use, easy to learn, and uh, because it's on a, a community, it's also easy to evaluate and easy to buy. Uh, we have a free evaluation version that people can get. These aren't SaaS tools, they're... No, they're, they're actually uh, tools that people can download in yeah. the traditional sense okay. uh, for, for PCB design. Uh, but in addition to, to the PCB tools, we also have services available for that. So one of the things we're announcing this week is our, um, our PCB fabrication service provided by a partner called Pentalogix. Now, Pentalogix is a uh, fab service that will do prototypes of your boards and they'll do them overnight for you. So um, we've provided on the community um, at element14.com slash PCB services a way of doing a one-click connection to get quotes for your, your design. So if you've got a prototype, you need one or two copies of that, uh, you're, you're not going to go to a contract manufacturer for that. Instead of going searching the web and trying to find somebody and, and probably going through uh, a lot of hoops to figure out how to get quotes from them, yeah. you can come to, to this design, uh, upload a Gerber file, and, uh, and get a custom quote. Um, and then if uh, you like the quote, you can uh, push the button and get the, the prototypes delivered to you overnight. So overnight? It's a, yeah. Wow. Very, very nice service provided by, uh, by Pentalogix. So, so let me back you up and talk about the tools. Those tools aren't, aren't yours, but you're providing a, a, a form to interact with them. Right, exactly. So uh, we, we have other tools available as well. CADSoft actually happens to be owned by Premier Fornell, which is a parent company for, for yeah. Element 14. So it actually is, in a sense, uh, our tool. Um, and uh, we're taking a lot of feedback from users on Element 14 on things to add to that tool. So uh, we've recently come out with a new version that uh, incorporates a lot of the feedback that we get from PCB designers around the world on things they'd like to see in a very low cost, easy to use PCB design tool. So how do you go about um, getting awareness for that sort of new, um, those new services, right? Because you're known for community. Your parent company's known for being a distributor. Right. How, how do you go about uh, building awareness for, hey, we're doing this now? Right, and, and it's, it's really about, you know, coming out to the design community and having them understand that in addition to community, we also have content, we also have components, and now we are adding design solutions. Yeah. So it's you know, the ability to pull that all together and provide a one-stop shop where they can get a really good experience uh, to find the information they need, as well as then find the tools they need and then the components, and now finally the service for getting their board done. So for PCB designers and embedded software designers, uh, the you know, people we're here to meet with at this show, um, it's a good place to come to find information about your design.
You've launched this now or just recently? or? Yeah, the services are now available. We're, we're announcing uh, Pentalogix this week as, as a service provider. Uh, CADSoft Eagle has been available for, for many years, obviously. Yeah. Uh, but uh, it's been part of, part of uh, the Element 14 community now for over a year. Um, and those are available today. Man, no grass is growing under your feet. <laughs> Absolutely not. Either you or Element 14. Jeff Jessel, thanks for coming by. Good to see you again. Right. Thank you. I appreciate your time. Uh, so check out Element 14 if you're if you're here. They're ubiquitous at uh, you know pretty much any show in the in the technology business, uh, and Element 14 online. And of course that their programming is uh, is definitely a must see TV, as we say, in internet land. So uh, one more guest to go in the next uh, couple of minutes, and then we'll uh, close down the show for the day. And you can, of course, see every segment we've done today and uh, yesterday archived just, be just below the little screen here. So uh, again, I'm Brian Fuller, Editorial Director from EE Life. Hang tight, because we'll be back in about five minutes or so.